All right, what is going on, everybody? It's Minibeck with another redstone tutorial video. Hey, wait, this this is even redstone. But in today's video, guys, I'm gonna be showing you how to make a bubble column elevator in Minecraft. So this is a very simple way to go up and down. What you need is some soul sand and magma blocks to start. And where you place the soul sand is where you're gonna go up, and where you place the magma block is where you're gonna be going down. And you basically just place the two blocks on the ground like that, and then you just build up walls around it. And that's literally pretty much the entire build. There's no redstone required whatsoever. This is literally the easiest and most efficient way to travel vertically in Minecraft. So yeah, you just put the walls up, you, if you want to put glass, you can put glass, but you can just put whatever you want up. And just make sure that you have the magma block and the soul sand isolated in there like that. Then you can break those two glass blocks, and then you want to build out a little bit and place signs to stop the water from running out. Or you could place fence gates or whatever, but I just sure. use signs. So, oh, well, that was very good of me, way to throw the sign. But just pay, place some signs on the sides, and those will actually stop the water from flowing out, which is what we're going to be doing here in a little bit. But first, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to add up these sides here. Just You don't have to do this, but I just think it makes it look a little nicer when you add the sides like this. So there we go, and then now what you want to do is you want to go up to the top and you want to add two buckets of water to the top, and that's going to be how you flow up and down. It's through water, so as you can see, the thing about it though is, you, as you see, I placed one water bucket, and you can clearly see the bubbles flowing up, but they stop at the top one block short because it's not a water source block. It has to be a water source block, so if you see bubbles stopping like that, make sure you place another water bucket there, and then it should fill in. As you can see down here, I have the same problem. I have to place another bucket, and there you go. It'll complete the whole column. And that's your elevator. It's literally that simple. No redstone whatsoever. It's the easiest way to travel vertically for sure in Minecraft and most efficient easily. There we go. And it's that simple. You can just walk in there, you can walk down and do whatever you want with it. And another great feature of these bubble columns is you can actually use them to transport items. As you can see, I uh, dropped that item right there and it floated up to the top and I can do it again. And just the same, you can also throw it into the bubble column that goes downwards and the item will travel downwards. So it's another very useful feature of these. Maybe I'll make another video on how to transport items soon, but yeah, that's literally the entire bubble column build. It's very easy to make, it's very resource friendly, like you really don't have to have anything to make it, and it's a really cool feature. And also, just a quick note, you don't have to just use one soul sand and one magma block. As you can see, you can stack them right next to each other, you can make it a 2x2, two two. you can literally make it as big as you want. As long as you have complete water source blocks above it, they will move up, they'll go down, you can have a whole bunch of elevators right by each other, so it's really that easy. But anyways, thank you guys all so much for watching. I know this is another Minecraft tutorial video, and I'm trying to get back to the funny moments videos, but those take time to edit, and of course, second week of online school. Teachers, let's all assign a million assignments this week, so school is the only thing holding me back right now, but I'm going to try to get more well-edited videos out to you guys, and I'm going to keep uploading every day, so stay tuned. Thank you all for watching. It's been Smitty. Peace out.